7 brings you more news with Sally Bowery. You're watching 7 News at 7. Weeknights on 7 2. From the studios of 7 Perth, Rick Arden and Susanna Carr. Now, Fuel Watch. Perth's petrol prices. Brought to you by Fuel Watch and 7 News. Hi there, there's been plenty of rain in the last 24 hours. Perth has seen more than 10 millimetres and there's more to come. Storms and heavy showers are forecast tomorrow. There's been some big falls too in the state's southwest. Walpole has recorded 49 millimetres. Right now it's 15 degrees in the city and winds are from the west southwest. We had an early max today at 10.40 this morning. It had peaked at 18.5, just four degrees higher than the overnight minimum. The heaviest rain has been recorded in the hills where there was 25 millimetres by 9am. Jin Jin picked up 14 and 11 fell at Bullsbrook. With the rain has come cooler temperatures across the southern half of the state. Albany got to just 15 degrees today. It was 19 in Esperance and Bunbury, 20 in Geraldton, with the highest max taken at Columbaroo, where it soared to 36 degrees. Tomorrow, showers and storms are forecast anywhere from Geraldton all the way down to Albany. It'll be wet in Esperance too, but dry in 21 in Kalgoorlie and sunny weather's forecast for the north. There's a few showers around tonight, mostly south of Perth and around Albany, and tomorrow's wet stormy weather will be caused by a low and cold front. They're set to hit the southwest and then move into the bite on Wednesday with another front forecast to hit later in the week. Interstate, it'll be dry and 22 degrees in Adelaide, 20 the top for Melbourne tomorrow, sunny and 21 degrees for Sydney, 26 and sunny in Brisbane and 33 for Darwin. On the water, winds will pick up, reaching 25 knots in the morning on seas and swell to two and a half metres. And it looks like winter will end wet and windy. Tomorrow we can expect storms and heavy showers. Up to 20 millimetres of rain is forecast with a top of just 17 degrees. It'll be wet again on Wednesday with showers continuing right through the week and even into the weekend, then finally clearing up next Monday. And just quickly, I'd like to wish Enrico and Aldine Brunini a happy 69th wedding anniversary. Have a good night. Here's Rick and Sue. Thanks, Angela. Don't forget our 7 o'clock news bulletin over on 7.2. Now let's go to Monica with today tonight. 7 News, the pulse of Perth.